Well, good morning, good morning. Good we morning. are just doing a uh, pit stop right now. And guess where we are stopping? Have a look at that over there. Uh oh, truck just had to block the view, but have a look at that. That is a nice sign. We are at the Tim Hortons in Canada. We are in Sycamore, BC right now. So I'll go in there and have me a nice coffee and we'll make our way down to Calgary. So we'll see you guys in a little bit. Well, it looks like it's another beautiful morning. We just finished our Tim Horton stuff. Got ourselves a nice sandwich and a large double-double. Actually, it was an extra large double-double that we had. And uh, yeah, it looks like it's gonna be a beautiful time going traveling through these mountains today. On our, on our way down, we had snow, but it uh, looks like uh, we might get lucky this time. Looks like we will not be having snow, it looks like. At least so far, I mean, things can change, right? But sky is not that cloudy. Got a little bit of fog hanging up there on the mountains, but other than that, the, the sky is clear, pretty much anyways. And, uh, yeah, so we should be in, uh, in Calgary, I think, probably by 4 o'clock our Manitoba time. Up here in BC, it's actually uh, two hours behind Manitoba time. So, I'd say if we say 4 o'clock, we'll be in Calgary, then it would be 2 o'clock in BC. Uh, according to Manitoba time, right? Alberta is only one hour behind uh, Manitoba, so... If we will be in Calgary at 4 o'clock our time, then we will be in Calgary at uh, 3 o'clock their time, so... But yeah, we'll get a, get a hammer down and keep on rolling, rolling, and we'll be there. Now I know this is going to be real scenic, sceneries. Beautiful, eh? We're going to be driving along the edge of this humongous mountain, eh? We got a couple of resorts on here, uh, just up ahead here. On the left, as you can see, we got, I guess, a river or lake, whatever you guys want to call it. But up here, they have avalanches sometimes. And uh, I got stuck in here a couple of years ago. Avalanche had happened right here. Got stuck here for a couple of hours. Actually, at that time, we were with our car. And we got stuck uh, in here for a couple of hours in the morning an avalanche had happened up here and shuts down the road you know but I just take a look at this uh, I don't know exactly what it is if it's a resort or something but it looks beautiful at least to me last time I came through here they had a helicopter sitting up there but today I don't see it up there but it's definitely a beautiful beautiful scenery up here I figured I'd show it to you guys. Hope you guys enjoy it. Riding along with me and get to see things that I see. Take a look at these humongous mountains up ahead of us. Got lots of snow up there, as you can probably see. Beautiful sceneries though. Pretty soon it's gonna be ready for uh, skiing, I guess. I don't do that kind of activity, but uh, hey, some people do. I would be too scared to go up there and ski, you know? Hey, some people love it. Yep, definitely beautiful scenery, that's for sure. Here we go. Now you can have a sneak peek on how deep it actually goes down there. I'm pretty sure you're going to be able to see that. This is where we truckers travel. Can you imagine driving here when it's winter? And everything is white, covered in snow. Oh yeah. You better be careful up here, I tell you that much. Well, guess what? I am at the rest area up here. As you can see, it goes up quite a bit up there. Just uh, parked over here and have a look at this. They got me some beautiful, beautiful mountains in the background there. Got a little bit of a lake. I know it's a little windy here, so you might hear a little bit of wind, but hey, I can't do nothing about that, so anyways, just figure I'd give you a little bit of a view that I got up here. Beautiful scenery. 
that's where we got the highway up there you see the trucks vehicles coming down there yep it's definitely beautiful up here well as you guys know this will be the last little stretch for our journey through the mound so enjoy it while it lasts guys Alrighty, we are done for today. We uh, got unloaded up here in Calgary today and uh, went over to the Husky, had a nice shower and went to a steakhouse just down the road here. It was a real nice steak that we got up there. So uh, we'll go to bed probably and go early tomorrow morning to go pick up our load. We got a reload out of uh, Lethbridge, Alberta and uh, it's just a trailer switch up there so it's supposed to be preloaded but it's supposed to be ready tomorrow morning so we'll go do that tomorrow morning and then we'll see you guys then so have a great one and thanks for watching <music>